Zomba is a city in southern Malawi. It was Malawi's capital until 1975. The British colonial past is evident in the architecture. The city is at the foot of the Zomba Plateau. Please join me as I explore this beautiful city of Zomba and subscribe to African Boss. And my name is Yao Bantu and sit tight and enjoy the attractions. Our first stop is a very important place in the history of Malawi. Uh, it is the King African Rifles Memorial from the First World War, 1914 to 1918. This is one of the best kept memorial, uh, mo memorial monuments in the whole of Malawi. Uh, we don't usually keep our monuments that well, but this is one of those. So we're going to have a closer look at it. The old name for Malawi was Nyasaland that time we were under the British. That's this door is from that era. So, so all around this tower there are these names. Uh, one of the most peculiar uh, thing that I've noticed about these uh, these names is that the British are on top, obviously, and they've got their initials, their full names. While the Africans, they just have their rank and then and their number and either their first or their last names. Uh, obviously, yeah, that's, that's how the things were at that time. On this road of honor, about 202 soldiers died. So same here, uh, a total of 104 soldiers died. Same thing, uh, he's 127. Uh, similar names, there's a like Pongolani, Pongolani, Sabu, Sabu, Said, Said, Said. So I wonder whether they were all rated brothers, possibly or just similar names. For snack time, I could not resist but go for Malawi's top snack on the street and that is hot chips and chicken. We're now in chocolate, a chocolate factory. Well, they make chocolate here, Malawian made chocolate. So we are going to see what this chocolate is all about. I'm so excited to visit this chocolate factory in Zomba. So let's go and see it. It's quite rich, it's not too sweet. It's just different from all the chocolate that you've ever had. You come to Malawi and have this chocolate. 
you won't regret it. For lunch, I could not help myself but enjoy our national dish, and that is sima. And I had sima with beef stew and some vegetable, and it was very delicious. And the sima and the beef stew cost roughly three dollars and eighty cents USA dollars, but that is because it was in a sort of a uh, a fancier restaurant but it is way cheaper on the street so we are right in the middle of zomba town so we had some food now we're gonna go up the zomba mountain i'm i'm just visiting botanic gardens of zomba this is another tour, uh, this is another place to come uh, to when you visit zomba but i think there is a waiting because there's a lot of people going to there so let's just go and see i'm so excited to visit this, this place i've heard about it so many times i just haven't been here but it's my first time to be here so let's go and have a look arrived at the plateau so you have to come to Kuchawa Inn and we're just gonna go inside the amazing views on Zomba mountain are something to die for you can virtually see the whole city and more so this is a beautiful beautiful view that is worth a visit right at the top it's about 15 20 kilometers right from the city of zomba it's a beautiful spot as you can see quite green and the weather is a bit cooler up here because it's uh, it's on a high attitude it's usually foggy here, but at the moment it's not. So you can actually see uh, the views. And this place is called Kuchawa Inn. Um, you know, where people come up here for uh, either to have a, a full accommodation or to just have a drink or two, uh, coffee, something like that. So that's why it's a very beautiful spot. I think everybody should come around here. This is the Mulunguzi Dam. It's a, it's a man-made dam. It's right at the at, on top of the Zumba. Catch, it's the main water, catchment, the main water for the for the residents of Zumba. Uh, I think they drink from from here. Um, I think the other side you pay a little fee to stay there, very small fee. But we don't need to pay here because uh, we're just sort of uh, taking a quick video. And um, yeah. 
and going because we're running out of time. But uh, this is the whole place here. And it's beautiful up here, it's cool. I think people hold parties and whatever else. But uh, yeah, it's right at the top of Zomba, Zomba Mountain. If you ever visit Zomba, make it a point to come here and see this beautiful, beautiful place. the road I'm just going to get some tomato and onions you gotta get some tomato and onions uh, fresh uh, on the side of the road on the way there's so many you have to stop somewhere and get them do a bit of bargaining but not too much let's see how much you can get off Okay, okay, so... 